All right, guys, welcome back. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate it. Uh, it's been a really long time since I've done a discussion video, probably like, I don't know, maybe a year. I don't know. It's been extremely long, but I got a question from Doc Harris, uh, one of my subscribers, I believe, right? If not, he watches frequently and leaves comments, so I appreciate that. But anyways, his question uh, was, he actually, he left me like a video article or uh, actually a website uh, link to an article, and it was talking about um, how all per, all all human jobs are going to be replaced by um, robots in the future and he wanted to know my thoughts on the article and it says that plumbers electricians and nurses are will be the last to lose their jobs to robots i didn't really read the article to be honest but uh, he wanted to know my opinions about it and um to be honest i don't think unless these robots are like extremely like I can't even describe it, but um, in my mind, there's just no way that robots are ever going to replace um, like con construction workers, um, either that's electricians, plumbers, uh, sprinkler fitters, insulators, just, just, I don't know, like the kind of robots that, I, robots that I'm thinking of are like the kind in like a warehouse, kind of like a production lines type of thing, um, but um uh, so I would assume that they would kind of need a track unless they're talking about like a human robot type of like a uh, I am legend sort of thing. But anyways, I would assume that that would not be possible to build some kind of uh, um, kind of like tracking system or like uh, production volume type of robot to uh, do any type of construction work or um, even like a even like a human robot, like I don't know how they would even program any of that stuff. There's just way too many variables with uh, drilling holes, hanging panels, you know, just name it, pulling wire, uh, stripping wire, making up wire, making up panels, just, just so many things to, to account for that I would assume that would be way too complex. And uh, like, even if you like dropped like a screw or something, or just like um, anything, anything like that, there has to be there would even have to be humans on the job to make sure that the robots are even doing the type of work correctly and not messing things up or if the robot breaks you know it just seems like way too much work to try to replace humans um in the construction field i mean ideally that would sound great to have robots do construction work i mean you'd lose your job but i mean um, it would make things a lot more easier and stuff but i honestly just don't ever see that happening um, so that's, those are my two cents. It's going to be a short little video, but anyways, appreciate the, the, um, uh, video topic and suggestion. And if you guys got anything else you guys want to see, um, leave me a comment below and I'll try to get to it. Um, no promises, but I do my best, um, when I get a chance and I know there's another video that I have to go through for someone else about how to pull wire, uh, through conduit and stuff. Cause that's a valid question. So anyways, I keep forgetting um, at the end of the day at work um, and I just have to um, grab some materials or whatnot and, or some tools and just kind of give you an example at work um, one of these days. And uh, anyways, that should do it, guys. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. As always, God bless. Have an awesome rest of your day. Check the description for anything else and hit the notification bell if you want to be notified when I upload or do live streams. And uh, if you enjoyed the video, hit like and subscribe. See you guys back here in the next one. God bless. Peace out.